I describe this in my book, Google Drive and Docs in 30 Minutes, but some people need uh, a visual explanation of how it works. There's a couple different parts of the screen, and the things that you really need to know are on the left screen is where the main organization of your folders takes place. Uh, you can see that there's my drive at the top. You can collapse that if you want. Um, and, but then what you like to do is expand it so you can see your folders. Folders makes it very easy to organize things. And then you can select a particular folder. So uh, EPUB, that's where I do all my book writing activities. If I click on that, it shows all the files that I have in there. Those appear in the middle of the screen, plus my little subfolders. Uh, this is organized alphabetically, but if I wanted to, I can change it so it's uh, sorted by last edited by me, which is a pretty common thing for me to do. Uh, so I was working on this last night, for instance. Uh, also on the left side of the screen are two very important buttons. The Create button lets you create a new Google Documents file. So that could be a word processing document, presentation, spreadsheet, etc. Or you can create a new folder. You click that, give, the, give the, the folder a new name, and then it will appear on the left side of the screen. This button is the Upload button. And typically what happens is you might have a file on your hard drive you want to store in Google Drive. Let's say a Microsoft Excel pre uh, spreadsheet. So you just click Files, you'd find it on your hard drive, and then it would upload, be uploaded to Google Drive. And the great thing about this is, if I open up Google Drive on another computer, that file is available to me, just like all the other files that I have. Top of the screen, very important function, searching for stuff. So let's say that I'm looking for uh, a document. I can't remember the title, but I know it has plan in the name. Okay, so let's see what comes up. And it looks like not much is coming up right now. Oh, here we go. So there's a whole bunch of different plans that I have right there. The other thing I can do is I can search just for certain types of files. Like, let's just find uh, PDF files that have that name in it, uh, that have the word plan in it. And see, there's a whole bunch of different files that I have uh, with the word plan. So this is a very useful way to find stuff because if you use Google Drive for a while, you'll have hundreds or even thousands of files. And... Uh, so hunting through folders is not fun. And finally over here is kind of all your account information and settings. The one that's pretty important for people to know is uh, if you click on your profile photo on the very right corner of the screen, the drop down menu, you can sign out. And that's pretty important to do if you're using a shared computer and you want to make sure that no one uh, sees your files. So anyways, that's the quick version of what's in Google Drive. If you want more information, uh, please check out my book, Google Drive and Docs in 30 Minutes. It's available at drivedocsin30minutes.com. Thank you.